Jorgo, it's great to talk to you. You have signed for Celtic on transfer deadline day. How does it feel to be a Celtic player? It's uh, really amazing. I'm uh, really excited to. Uh, I'm looking forward to to wear this uh, this t-shirt with pride. Um, uh, it was always uh, a team that uh, I really liked. Uh, I was watching uh, many games in the past, and uh, yeah, it was uh, uh, this amazing atmosphere in this uh, stadium. This is something else, and uh, I'm looking forward to to live uh, these moments and uh, to write our our history together. Yes, a lot of this atmosphere is is created by goal scorers. You, of course, are a goal scorer. How much are you looking forward to to contributing to that atmosphere? I think um, I'm already here in my in my ears uh, the the stadium celebrate with my first goal so i'm really looking forward to, to score my first goal with uh, our fans and uh, celebrate together and of course europa league group stage football to to look forward to our supporters are very much looking forward to that what can they expect from you as a player uh, the only thing i can tell you is that um, i'm really proud uh, i'm really i'm really happy and excited that I signed for uh, this beautiful club and uh, I will give my 100% every game, every single game, uh, help my team uh, win every every game because this is the only target that uh, Celtic should have, uh, the win in every game, if it, even if it's Europa or uh, Premiership. You were the top scorer in the Eredivisie last season. We. We've seen you score with your left foot, your right foot, your header. Would you call yourself an, an all-round centre forward? Yeah, thanks. Thank you, God. Uh, we had this uh, had this uh, beautiful season last year. Uh, unfortunately, without fans, this was something that made me sad. Sad. And um, now I try to improve every day because I want to to, uh, to be able to score with uh, every possible way. And uh, this is something that I would. Try to to do it every single train in every single training to improve my my strong uh, points and uh, also my weak points even more. And I hope I can score uh, with every every single uh, way uh, with uh, Celtic. Celtic fans are have got fond memories of one particular Greek striker who performed so well for the club for a six-year period, Georgios. Samaras, is that someone that, that you followed when he was here? Yes, yes, of course, of course. Uh, at this time, I was looking at a lot of uh, his games, many of his games, and um, we worked together in uh, in Greece. He, he is now a president of uh, one uh, beautiful club where I came from, of Greta, and uh, I played there before two years. Um, so we really know each other, and uh, we, we keep in touch. Uh, I know m many things from him uh, and that's why I'm looking forward even more to, uh, to play for Celtic. What did he tell you about the club? So There's a big club with uh, crazy fans. The atmosphere is amazing and uh, that I represent uh, one uh, very, very, very big club and the only target every game is to win. The new manager, Ange Postacoglu, plays a very attacking style. Is that something that will, that will suit you? This was um, one of the main reasons that I really wanted to, to sign uh, for, this, uh, for this beautiful club because uh, the, the, type, the style of playing is uh, really something that uh, really fits to me. Well, we can't wait to welcome you in, in Glasgow. Yorgo, I know you, you'll be here later on this week um, and we wish you well for your Celtic future. Thank you very much. I'm also looking forward to come and uh, meet the fans, meet the old guys and uh, start together to, to build something really good.